This is KBOI 2 News, first at 4. Good afternoon, but we are starting with some breaking news. The Idaho County Coroner has now identified the remains found on the banks of the Salmon River as University of Idaho student Kayla Dannenberg. KBOI 2's Sarah Jacobson spoke with her mother about what this news means for her. Brent Natalie, I spoke with Kayla's mother, Robin Dannenberg, yesterday, and she says that after a year of wondering, she can now bring her daughter home to rest. Robin says that Kayla was the light of her life and that she was a kind and compassionate person and that waiting for a year only gave her hope that her daughter was still alive. She tells me after the remains were found just three days ago, she was contacted by investigators asking if Kayla had an impacted baby tooth on her right side. She says that's the moment she knew it was her daughter. You know, the first time I, 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 was, I was totally all I, all I could do is weep all the time I cried. And this time, it really hurts. It really, really hurts because, because it's final. And, and that was my baby. Robin tells me her relationship with her daughter was a special one. She says that even after the accident, that she could still feel her daughter with her. Now she tells me the identification of Kayla's body will help her close the door a little more, but that ultimately it will never be shut. Reporting live in studio, Sarah Jacobson, KBY 2 News. Sarah, thank